Hey everybody, welcome to another edition of Router 2 Brief with Steve as your host. Hey, how you doing? Happy Saturday. Hope you guys got your coffee going, as I always do. Uh, I got a new anemone and the uh, JBJ45. Check it out. It's a Haitian anemone. Really nice. Let me give you guys a description. Now here you see it in my JBJ45. Uh, we went out that night and I bought one because I liked it so much. It just looks really gorgeous. So the Haitian anemone, it's a reef anemone. It's uh, no, also known as the pink tip condi or pink tip anemone. It's found near Haiti in the lagoons or in the inner reefs uh, in loose groups. And it's never found in clusters. It has a red column with long tapering pink tip tentacles you, as you can see. It's purple, translucent, it's really nice. Uh, now the Haitian anemone requires really strong light. It should never be purchased if you don't have a really good lighting system. My lighting system in this JBJ45 is pretty inexpensive but it does a great job and it's been doing really well under this light. Uh, so it's going to do really well in an aquarium with live rock and several crustaceans. Although the anemone requires a reef environment, it's not best suited for the reef aquarium. I didn't know that when I bought it. The Haitian anemone moves around the tank and has a sting that can inflict uh, grave damage to other anemones and corals. Do not include its natural predators, such as the red-legged hermit crab. Unlike other anemones, the Haitian reef anemone does not have a relationship with any particular fish, and it is rare for any type of clownfish or damsel to reside within them. The diet, which I did not know, should include feeding of fish, mussels, shrimp, or other foods of this type. So I wasn't really aware of how dangerous this anemone was. And being that this is a all clown tank, the JBJ45, this is probably the wrong choice. However, it was so beautiful, I just had to have it. I'll see you guys next Saturday. Comment, subscribe, like it and share. Have a great one. Take it easy, guys.